Hey, what's up guys? This is Saul here from the GTA Elite Real Estate team. And in this video, we're gonna share with you guys the stats for November 2022 in Mississauga's real estate market. And we're going after it right now. Welcome to our channel. If this is your first time here, we do a lot of videos about everything you need to know about eating, sleeping, playing, and all the different neighborhoods right here in Mississauga and the surrounding GTA. So make sure you tap that subscribe button, hit that little bell so you're notified every time we do a brand new video. And we're getting lots of phone calls, emails, and texts, and we absolutely love it. So if you're in the market to make a move, purchase, or sell your home, reach out to us. You can click on our appointment in the description below. You can click on that and set up a 30 minute appointment with us, or you can text us at 289 569-1940, as well as visit our website at findgtalistings.com. All right, let's get to the stats. All right, let's talk about the detached real estate market stats first in Mississauga ending November 2022. So the uh, stats that we're going to consider are sales, active listings, the months of inventory in the market, again, that's defined by the number of homes that need to sell to clear out everything that's for sale as long as no other homes come to the market. And the uh, uh, months of inventory, just to briefly show you, is that if it's a, a seller's market, you're going to have less than four months of inventory. If it's a balanced market, it will be between four to five, four to six months of uh, inventory. And then the months of inventory over six months considers a buyer's market. So. The average price is the other stat we're going to consider and then the days on market. So let's look at November's sales. So it's been 166 sales that have sold uh, for detached homes in Mississauga. Um, and that's num num number has been consistent from July till November. Just August was pretty, pretty busy with almost 200 sales, but uh, averaging out around 160, 150, 160 range. And then the active listings have dropped. It's a more of a seasonal thing because normally homes um, don't usually go on the market as much in the winter time around Christmas. So that number has dropped 17%. The months of inventory is 2.3. So it's still pretty much a seller's market in Mississauga for detached homes. And the average sales price is 1.43 million. So just a little bit higher than last month, almost 3%. Um, so you can see that uh, the numbers are kind of leveled off a little bit from September all the way till now, um, you know, and then uh, that results in days on market of 21 days. So, um, yeah, so right now the detached market is uh, sort of leveling off. We just had a rate announcement last uh, or actually yesterday uh, going up to 0 0.5 in the interest rates. Now they are saying that. It could result in a little bit more slowdown for uh, interest rate increases coming up next year. We'll have to see what happens with that. But as far as I know, um, it looks like uh, sellers are holding out. They're not uh, putting their homes on the market as much and they're not giving up their properties. Um, you know, they're not reducing their prices that, at the moment. So the pressure and the, the pain hasn't hit the, the consumers yet uh, or it might not even do that. I don't know. So uh, let's go into semi detaches. Okay, so for semi detaches, there was 45 sales last month. That's a 21% drop. And uh, active listings has dropped as well. 62 active listings right now. That's an 18% drop. Months of inventory, it's quite surprising. 1.4. It's still uh, a hot seller's market for semi detaches. And the average sales price is 984,000 very similar to numbers from July till now um, hovering around a million dollars and it takes about 17 days to sell a, a semi detached in Mississauga so from last month to this month's almost uh, very similar and uh, so semis there's um, yeah not too many listings on the market so they're holding up on their prices all right, next is freehold townhomes. So these are townhomes without any monthly condo fees or maintenance fees. Um, in Mississauga, there's quite not quite a lot of homes like this for sale. Um, there's only been 11 that have sold uh, and 28 um, active listings. So um, yeah, there's not too many of these going up for sale right now. And it's a 2.5 months of inventory. Um, and the average price is a million and six. So surprisingly, the freehold townhomes are are uh, selling uh, average sales price is higher than semi so there could just be um, less less uh, stats for that one so results in fewer 
uh, numbers to compare with uh, as far as semis there was more sold so there's more numbers to average it out but yeah about a million six for a semi and a freehold townhouse in mississauga right now and then the days on market takes about 24 days um so yeah the the, the values have gone up for for these types of homes okay next on the list is condo towns so condo towns um, represent the majority of the townhomes in mississauga that have uh, recently sold so 68 have sold last month 170 active listings and uh, 2.5 months of inventory the average price so this is good for uh, people that want to upsize from their condo to a townhouse it's 782,000 very similar to uh, the numbers we've been experiencing moms honestly till about from May onwards. So it's been kind of stable um, They haven't dropped as much as uh, like for example detached homes um, But uh, this is interesting the um, days on market is 31 days. So it takes about 31 days to uh, to sell a home here So yeah, uh, that's quite high and then um, that's 40% increase from the previous months. All right, last on the list is condo apartments. So condo apartments represent the majority of the type of homes that have been selling in Mississauga. So there was 118 um, so sales last month for apartments. Um, 397 are actively for sale. And uh, the months of inventory have been creeping up to 3.4. So this is moving more towards a balanced market. Um, the average price has dropped to 600,000. So if you're looking for an apartment um, you know this is a, a good opportunity right now to uh, to explore a better options a better pricing compared to uh, you know the highs of 735 back in March and then it takes about 27 days to sell in an apartment here I hope you found that information very valuable if you are in the market to buy or sell or just want to have a discovery call to just chat with us there's an appointment in the description below. You can schedule a 30 minute discovery call with us and we can figure out if we can help you out on your buying or selling needs. As well as if you are wanting to just reach out to us, you can call us at 289-569-1940 or visit our website at findgtalistings.com. Thanks for watching this video and we'll see you on another one.